Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Next Mod Extinction on Steam with me, Jalanon, at Luna Nebula Gaming. We are going to the Drake Islands. Because we can. Apparently, people don't hate Lydia yet, so, yeah. We're going here. Oh, hey! Lydia's waiting for us over there. She can show us a good place to set up the tyrant radar. You know, probably on the site of a former battlefield or something. Cool. Hurry up, Jalanon. I know the perfect spot for Atlas. He'll be able to scan the world below for tyrants without any problems. Oh, yes. Do I need to take down Eurus first, though? Hmm. Well, in that case, we have Repto Motor. So we should be fine. Hmm. You know what? Just in case. We're doing that. And, yeah, I think we're good for now. Okay. Oh, yes. You have something to do. Secret sauce. Yes. I accept. There we go. So uh, we should be able to feed people better now. Yes. Okay. So that was something I forgot to come back for. So we're going this way. Aha! Uh -huh. Finally! Now we have a purpose for this place. This is the most appropriate area to set up your radar. From here, we can find all the tyrants before Vado hunts them down. So this is what Dino wanted me to do, huh? All right, time to scan the world. All right, Atlas. We depend upon you to sit here and look at the world. Well, what do you see, Atlas? Hmm. The radar is working. I can see the tyrants. One, two, three, four. There are four tyrants out there. Wonderful. If we can recruit them all, we might actually stand a chance against Vados. Truly, fate seems to be in our favor for once. I bet one of them disappears from the radar after... Yeah. <laughs> but then again, apparently they'll keep getting born, so that's interesting. Any news, Vados? Hmm. Why, yes. I have located quite a few tyrants. Is that so? Four. Four tyrants within my grasp. Yes. Four tyrants? That's remarkable, Vados. If you can slay them, it will be a huge step forward for us. Absolutely, Amelia. I won't fail you. I will decimate them at your command. Then, defeat the tyrants, Vados. Prove to the world that you are on the side of humanity. Too bad she doesn't know about the whole continuous birth of tyrants thing. Because maybe that would change her mind. Oh, Molsomer. Here you are. <laughs> Don't you worry, Molsomer. Once you recover, we will take over Ignitia for sure. They will see. We will have our revenge. Or, you know. Not. Huh? What was that? What is going on? What is this power? Ah. The fact that the magma isn't being blown away like a wave is interesting to me, so it must absolutely destroy whatever it hits. Ugh! What is this? Mulsimer! Mulsimer! Plus the fact that he can just do that from anywhere as Vados, that... Yeah, I don't think we could outpace that. Unless he has to recharge. Oh, is Navalis hiding in there? Hmm. What to do? What to do? The guild has finally revealed the existence of Vados. A super Nexomon, they call it. No worries, though. The old tower is a good shelter. We'll just hide here and... Whoa there. The sound. Where is it coming from? You may want to step back a little bit. Ah. Navalis! What the heck? Hmm. Yeah, I think we're too late. Well, Bolzin helped create Vados. Hmm. If I'm not mistaken, Vados must be hunting down the tyrants of the surface. All according to plan. <laughs> Vados will be weakened from so much effort. He will be vulnerable. Ah, that was your plan all along. That will be our chance to betray Amelia and take over her guild. Literally nothing can go wrong. Didn't you help her create Vados? What? Amelia? Well, uh, yeah. I mean, she said she was going to destroy all tyrants. Oh, Eurus counts, too. He's just sleeping. 
<sighs> this is not good. Just five more minutes. Well, at least you had a nap first. Totally worth it. And that was on the Drake Isle, so I was thinking he was only targeting things on the planet itself, but apparently he can't detect the main character. Achievement unlocked downfall. No way. This is this is impossible. Atlas and tyrants? I'm afraid so. The tyrants are gone. All of them. We lost? We we lost before we even started? Everything we've done for nothing. Why? Why is this happening? That's a good question. Maybe we'll find Z. Jelena. Jelena. Can you hear me, child? Don't give up hope yet, Jelena. There is one more tyrant. You can still win. Watch carefully, Jelena. Open your eyes. Wait, what? Okay, I can't move this. This is a cutscene thingy. The grand capital city of Param. Go to the capital city. Hmm. Is Meta in hiding or something? The former Nexa Lord? Or is it in a statue? I mean, technically I'm a tyrant. Right? Oh, if you go to Param, then he can't launch the beam because it would hurt people. In the capital city, there's a forbidden pathway to Calm Woods. Also that. Also that. So finally we get to go to Calm Woods. You must intrude. You must make your way there at any cost. I'm betting this is Dina talking, but I don't know. What you see is a safe haven that not even Vados can see. A shelter from his wickedness. A paradise within a battlefield. You must come here, Jelena. You must come to me. Yeah, it's probably Nara. Huh. Or not. Oh, it's a nice tyrant. The other tyrants may have been slain. But there's still one way to outsmart Vados. You must hurry, Jelena. I am your ally. I am waiting for you. Hmm. Interesting design. Looks like it has hooves on the outside of its arms. Are you kidding me? A tyrant just talked to you? He wants you to come to the capital? Oh, he. I'm sorry. This is definitely a trap. Come on. Have you heard of a forest in the middle of the city, Lydia? Actually, yes. Huh. Looks like she lost her will to fight. Well, it's not like we've got any other option. Let's go to the capital city. We were pardoned by Edward, so nobody will stop us. That's right, Atlas. Look on the bright side of life. Oh, Jelenon. Sorry, I need a moment alone. You said that there's still one tyrant left? Inside the capital city. I... I find it impossible. How come Vados hasn't found him? Think about it. Also, they put the wrong name above this speech bubble. Oh well. It's okay, Valeria. We'll we'll try to keep the hope alive. You just come to us when you're ready. Do 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 do. All right then. Hmm. Anything else I need before we go into almost certain danger, slash supposedly not danger? Hmm. Do I want new nexo traps? Let's craft. Hmm. I could use some more of these. And you know what? I got a bunch of you, so yeah, we'll we'll do that. Okay. We have done it. Wait a second, did I ever do this? I didn't. What? Okay, well I've learned. Greed wallet. Joy. More money. Oh. Huh. I am stuck. There is nothing here yet. One day there may be. As we have so often found in this game. I guess you could say it's a Metroidvania, ha! Ah, except not. Anyway, let's go to Param and then the Woods. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Huh, so this is what became of Param. It gives me the chills just thinking how close we are to Vados. I did some research and there's a small force accessible at the northwest side of the city. Yep, we knew that. Because we are very, very good at poking our nose where we shouldn't be yet. Uh, do I need to heal? Not really? Okay. We will not waste time then. Forward! To the northwest! 
So more diagonally than forward, but you know, you get the point. All right. Away we go into the woods. Ah, but we may have to break through the gill. They may or may not like me still. Hmm. I doubt I have any more synergy cores I could make. So we go this way. Anything new to say? The Himikon Woods may have been the birthplace of Ulza, the legendary hero. For that reason, lots of people want to visit the woods. Who doesn't want to learn more about Ulza? It's so unfair. Oh, yep. We've talked to you before. What about you? Excuse me, you don't have an access card, do you? Only authorized tamers and researchers may visit the woods. Do we know any scientists who can lend us an access card? This place is full of them. Somebody around here should be willing to give us access. You know... We may have some friends in the scientific community, thanks to our efforts and our research. Mm -hmm. I wonder if going here matters at all. Because there's the previous sub. That's probably another way to get to Cadium. Uh, anything new hiding around here? No. We're good. We good. Alright. Scientists, I call upon your favors. Because I have done stuff for you. So, please. I can't has. I can't has access card. Aha, I figured it'd be Bonnie. She's too nice. Oh, Jonah. What is it? Do you need something? Con Woods, huh? Uh, it's not a big deal, really. It's just a bunch of colorful trees and whatnot. Yeah. Well, as long as you're not doing anything fishy again, I wouldn't mind letting you in. You are a gold tamer, after all. All right, Jonah. You can borrow my access card. Okay. Mmm. So, in terms of... Whoops. That must be Vados. He's growing a little impatient trying to find more tyrants to hunt. Ah, a little impatient, I see. Don't worry about it, though. Have fun in the woods, John. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But uh, in terms of security, do not give away your own access card to someone else to use. That's just asking for trouble. You should make them an access card, so then they have their own access card, and you can track exactly what they're doing. Slash where they've been, slash if somebody steals it, and you know they've stolen it, then you can figure out where that is. Anyway, what about you? Only scientists allow me... Oh, Chalma, I know that you're a high-ranking tamer, but... An access card? So Bonnie gave you permission. All right, sir. Please go ahead. do 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 do, -do. I outrank you, soldier. Ha 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 ha. And I have a cool card. It's a collectible. Okay, con woods. I like that little mushroom. Okay. Oh, look at this place. It's plagued with scientists. Are you really sure that there's a tyrant hiding here? My radar should have picked up something already. Well, if you can't pick it up, then neither can Vados, right? Uh, which reminds me, how did they get the tyrant radar technology? Hmm. I guess they knew about Atlas all along. Oh, it's not that common to see a guild tamer in these woods. Anyway, I doubt that you'll find anything interesting here. What about you, sir? It took us ages to get permission from the guild to survey these woods. Well, no, there aren't any valuable shards at all. Well, at least not enough to be worth your time. Onigiri? Unlike in the rest of the world, the Nexomon in this area aren't actively trying to harm us. This behavior has the guild baffled. This is how Nexomon were originally, many centuries ago. Okay, I want to catch him. Hello, friend. Oh, well. You do not care... To not be aggressive, apparently. Hmm. All right. Well, incinerate. Goodbye. Do 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 do. Alrighty. Wait a second. I don't need Reptomotor in front anymore. Borgun. Yes. There we go. What about you? If the archives are correct, there used to be a village in this place. The alleged birthplace of Olzar, huh? Oh, they're still hiding themselves? Okay. I get it, I get it. In the first game, they had magical power stuff. <gasps> we found your brother, slash sister, slash other plant being. Hmm. Intriguing. Yellow. All right. Well. We are good. All right. Hmm. Do I try... Sure. Orgoon can probably, yeah, probably take out this common. Oning. It's not like he's 
weak against grass, which always throws me off. Because I keep thinking Pokemon. <laughs> Psychic Siphon. Ooh. No, we will ignore him. We will ignore you. All right. It might be cool, though. Mm. For now, we ignore him. Doop -a -doop -a -doop. Bush Gnome. Huh. You have, like, carrot noses. That's interesting. Um, let us drill. Okay. Then I think incinerate won't kill. Because it's higher level. It's probably got enough HP. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, poison! Curses. Um, I will switch to Reptu in there, too. Though, actually... Maximum makes more sense. Anyway, we're going to ignore my issues. So we get an extra 3% from the secret sauce. Okay, and it looks like if we get one more secret sauce, there's probably one more left in the game, then a perfect berry will automatically do as much as possible, it looks like. Okay. You like chocolate cake? Mm -hmm. Anyway, enjoy that bush note. Ah, the plasma. Well, we have greater than a coin flip now. Take this, Bushnoom. So there's a chance they have enough secret sauces in the game that a normal food that they like will actually reach the limit. Anyway. A wise and ancient Nexomon that lives in tall grass near rivers. It is rumored to transform into trees in order to go unnoticed. Huh, that seems smart. Alright, you. Enjoy the storage party. Hmm... Uh, I do want to check if there's another new thing. Aw, we had you already. But you are adorable. Um, what to do? What to do here? I think we incinerate. And that worked. I should probably give you poison resistance, huh? or the poison null antidote thing. The antidote. I should give you the antidote. Anyway, moving on. Through the trees, into the woods, other stuff, give me the goods. A tamer, huh? What do you expect to find here? Trust me, buddy, I've been here for months and there's really nothing to see other than this really cool pollen stuff. Hi there, do you need some healing? Yes. All right, let's see now. Done, your party's all ready for action. Cool. What about you? I hate to complain, but nothing ever happens here. Even the next one in the area are fine, unless you step on them in the tall grass. Ah, that explains a lot, actually. Okay. What a waste of resources. Amelia made us research this place for no good reason. We should be focusing on ways to defeat the tyrants, not this. I mean, if you could pacify all the Nexomon, then you don't have to worry about tyrants, right? If you just make them happy. Hmm. Anyway. Opinion me. I could be wrong. Ooh, is this a Spencer Vault? Wait a second. Ooh, there's a ghost tamer. Well, hello there. <laughs> That's right. I found the secret cave because I'm a ghost. I haven't told anyone about it yet. Oh, you'd like me to stay quiet? Well, back in my day, we decided everything with a Nexomon battle. So let's roll. Also, how do you still have a bandage on as a ghost? Swamp low. Hmm. Well, this certainly seems like a good place for Ace Gone to level up. Rawr. I use Incinerate. It is very effective. Though apparently it will not KO in two. Yeah. Dang. Swamplow. You got that large amount of HP. Chaparral? Hmm. Chaparral? Chaparral? Orologicus. Well, I think your time is up. Shortly. Because this isn't going to kill. So I said that one liner way too early. But you're going to remember it now. Alright, back to. I could switch to Fantra or Reptile Murder. Eh, Fantra. Let's do it. We will show them the power of the Phantasm. Dead birds. There we go. And bada bing bada bing. There we go. Chaparla can probably go down to Black Flame. Yep. There we go. Yay, Orgoon. Devet. Devet's catching up. 
Whoa, it's been centuries since I had such a good fight. All right, all right, buddy. I won't tell those boring scientists about this cave. I promise. Okay. He will probably keep his word. For a man with such boxing gloves knows the weight of his word. Probably because he'd get punched in the face if he doesn't keep it. Well, let's be real. It's probably who he hangs out with. There are consequences to breaking one's word. Alright, so... If I go this way... Okay, it just depends on which direction you face, I think. Which makes sense to me. Alright, then. It's just normally it doesn't really matter what direction... Well, no, I take that back. It has matter which direction you face. Hmm. Hmm. I may have learned something. Anyway. Moving on. We can drill through. There we go. What a boom. Making that XP happen. Good. Now then. More jumping. Oh, wait. It's probably a new power. Oh, the power of Earth, right? Grunda never had us break anything. It doesn't seem like the scientists ever got this deep into the woods. Whatever lies beyond this cave must have been undisturbed for a really long time. Maybe you're right about a tyrant hiding here. But why can't Vado sense this place? Or me. And my cool tech. Technology! You have failed me once again. Technology! Why aren't you really my friend? Here we go. Yoink. Power of Earth. So there's probably other boulders we can break now. I don't remember seeing one. Hmm. Hmm. I will save just in case. Because there may be a boss fight coming up. And you never know. You never really know. But there was a healing stone, which makes me think that I may indeed guess correctly. Or not. Hmm. Oh, I kind of want to look for new Nexamon. Okay. Ooh, some glad to you. Meet the drill. Ooh. I did not do much damage at all, so... What was that actually for? Hmm. Okay, well that did more damage. There we go. Singletti, I bet you like spaghetti. Which I probably don't have. But I, I would try, if I had spaghetti, to feed it to you. Oh wait, you like me. Unexpected carnivorous plant. But, uh, not the weirdest thing ever. No. No, right, Mexo Trap, go! Mm -hmm. Okay, Singletti. We join storage party. Yes! Storage party! A special type of Nexamon that is always looking for its soulmate, Singlet. Okay. Send storage. There you go. We will try to find you your soulmate. Which is probably, you know what? Probably a better chance of it than any of those dating sites. Let me put it that way. Hmm. Though I have had friends have very decent luck on those. As in, they did get married, so. Yeah. That is the goal. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Anything up there? I can't get there from here yet. Hmm. On stone plinth. Aha. Wait, I should have lightning power too. What happens if I light these up? Huh, looks like someone built this to keep outsiders away. There must be a mechanism to operate the gates somewhere nearby. Okay, so I can't use it yet. Uh -huh. Yeah, let's skip that side I was just exploring. I can go down that. I can probably come back up. Right? Yeah, okay, I can still go back up. This has been persistently wiggling. But there is no new Nexomon here. We still have less than half, so it's probably better than halfway chance we find something new. But then again, commons probably appear more often. Hmm, Screech. No. A Devet has not evolved. Is Devet a final form? Hmm. Or just a one form. Like Florizard. Well, I mean, Orgoon didn't become a thing until level 37, so... Maybe... Hmm... Maybe, maybe. Maybe it's Maybelline. I don't know. Shrumbrella. That's cool. Anyway. Appreciation over. Now it is time to fight. 
Okay, we need to give Orgoon more HP if we're going to use healing soon. Hmm. Eventually. Uh, Rock Barrage is probably fine. Yeah, there we go. And now we feed. What do you like, Shrombrella? It's been a while. Ah, uh, watermelon. Go! Shrombrella really enjoyed it. Ah, the poison, though. Ooh. Well, we have healing stone. So we'll do that. You know, healing stone just isn't as good as heal, is it? Hmm. Yeah, no, it's not. Which I guess is part of the point, but hopefully we can get him a uh, heal later in the move set or something. I could probably just check with the next Mon person. Trainer. Uh, I do need to switch you. I'll switch to you. Hmm. Nexo trap. Go! We want that little umbrella over our heads. In case of any crazy things falling from the trees. Yeah! Thank you, Shrombrella. We appreciate you. Okay. The more spores, the more energy. It blooms an extra head to collect more humidity from the air. Okay. I mean, that makes sense. Alright, Trumbrilla. Hmm. We can jump back up. Uh, oh. More stuff to explore. Okay, nothing down here like I was hoping. Got it. Check in here. Seedco. Hmm. I don't think I can afford to use Incinerate. No. In fact, I can't even afford to use another one of those, so... I don't think Bullet Seed will kill, because it's ineffective? Yeah, okay. There we go. Feed you, I will. Because I'm a friend now. Okay. Forest Energy. Not doing all that much to me. Okay. There we go. Seed Co. Oh, you're not my seed bro yet. Uh -huh. We'll try again. Seed Co. Wouldn't you like to be a seed bro? Do, 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 do. Greater than coin player. There we go. Seed bro. All right. A light Nexamon capable of soaring in the wind and propelling itself using the two blade leaves on its head. It changes direction using the weights on its lower body. Well, that's interesting. Huh. I feel like that'd be pretty difficult. And, like, you'd have to swing around and stuff, and then that would probably be bad over time, and so on and so forth. Okay, well, this may have one of those generators in here. Ooh. Hmm. We might have time to find it. Let's see. We'll keep looking. I want more shards. Glorious. We do that. Ah, I see you, Generator. Ah. Algon? Hmm. Well, Algon... Can't incinerate. Flame is probably going to do something like 58. Hmm. Seems to have pretty decent defense. I'm going to risk it. Okay, good. No crit. So, what do you like? Hmm. None of those... Really? Not even the cram, eh? Strawberry cake, I should have just gone to the right. Alright, Algon really enjoyed it. Okay then, Algon. It's time for your dance to join the party. We need more leaf dancers. It adds a really cool special effect to the disco floor we're trying to install on the computer. Algon was caught. Booyah. Although this Nexamon lives underwater, it possesses plant characteristics and powers. It occasionally pops out of the water to perform photosynthesis. Sweet. All right, Algon. There you go, my algae dragon. Let's jump here. Oh, that's literally just a shortcut. <laughs> that's kind of fun, though. Mind shard. Uh, the plebeians can walk the path. I will jump it. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Uh, Scalder. Oh, we finally found you, did we? Hmm. You will probably just kill it. Hmm. You probably will... Bullet Seed shouldn't. Right? I mean... In theory, that's fine. Yeah. 
There we go. All right, that does hurt. My feelings. Natural heal. We'll just try to heal up a little bit too while we're doing this. Why not? Okay, as long as it misses, we keep healing. Joy. All right, what do you want to eat? Hmm. Aha, cream puff. Enjoy. There you go, Skulder. And then... Uh, we're not quite where we started in this battle, but that's okay. Do -do 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 -do. Scalder. Yeah. Here we go, Scalder. It uses its long tongue to help stabilize underwater, then benefits from a super aerodynamic tail to increase the speed of its moves. Hmm. So wait. Is that mustache looking thing actually a tongue? Huh. I'm not sure how I feel about that. It looks like it's on the outside of its body. Uh, we have to jump there probably from the higher level. Okay, I see that Grundabash thing. There's a couple of rocks in there. I have one too. Hello, friends. Let's let you out. Or are you upset that I did that? Hello? Yeah, they're upset. Okay. <laughs> Probably not how a Raxima sounds, but you know what? Oh, 342. Hmm. Yes. Difficult you may be. But incineration, I think, will set me free. Mm. Yep, and you're burning, which means you take a percentage of your health, as far as I can tell. Alright, another burn. Mm, I will go ahead and use a normal potion, actually. Because I don't think I need a super one. Okay. And then I can just flame and win. Flame! Ah! I take it back. That was incorrect. I would get hit, then flame and win. There we go. Orgoon. Mace gone. And a vet. All lovely. It's glorious. Okay. Well, unfortunately, we couldn't be friends with those Raxma. That kind of stinks. Looks like we have to go even higher. Uh, and that other room does go to a healing stone. So, you know what? We will go back. Go over here. Hmm, it's about time to end the episode, I think. I'm going to get at these if I get in a battle while I'm getting these. Then I'll feel better about using a healing stone after. But, oh well. All right. We will move on. I see you, treasure chest. Don't you hide from me. Uh, we will just flee from Mermella. Because why not? Okay. Do, 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 do. Here we go. Alright then. One more shard for the road. Get me that thing. Cosmic charm. Okay. Potion. So we replace the one we used. And we're doing just fine. We already have an Algon. And down we go. Down we go again. Hmm. A lightning. Huh. Looks like something happened outside. Should we leave now? Leave now. I'm glad they do that in this game. Alright then, let's get going. Though it would be nice if the character was always there so you could choose whether or not to leave now. But, yeah, I'm pretty sure we're good. So leave a like if you've enjoyed Nepsi 1 Extinction, dear viewer. Subscribe for more gaming videos. Comment below on what you think the next power-up will be, because it's probably going to be plant-related. And, um, I don't know, it seems like we can just burn plants and stuff already, so why would we need a plant power? Unless it's to, like, grow a rope bridge or something. So we'll figure out what happened here next time. Have a great day.